Okay guys, here we are on Kuta Beach, trying out the street food. Our first stop, Satay Babi. So you get it on a nice little plate. This is uh, pork, in case anyone was wondering. So we got 10 pork skewers for $2.50. And I believe this is some sort of rice kind of cake. We'll try it in a second, of course with uh, sambal chili sauce. All right, let's give it a go. Really good, really juicy. I can taste like it's marinated in a, in a lemongrass bit with chili. With a bit of chili on there, always. When I asked for rice, I thought they were gonna give me a bowl of rice, but this is uh, a rice cake, but uh, here it goes. I don't think I've ever had rice cake before, but it tastes pretty much exactly what it sounds like. It's like sticky rice. Fantastic. Okay, so my first impressions, it's actually the pork is coated in a mix of chili, ginger, garlic, lemongrass and sugarcane, um, which gives it this really nice, sweet, spicy kind of coating, but um, let's give it a try. I will not be participating in the sambal. Yeah, that's so good. Also, a couple of them, the middle piece on the skewers is actually fat. I don't know if you can see, but that is um, pork fat, which obviously just makes it really like juicy and tender. Um, and I'm gonna try rice cake. Ryan hit the nail on the head. It tastes like, it's just compressed rice. Like they've taken rice, compressed it into a cake um, and chopped it up. Uh, but it is fantastic. Okay, so that was a grand total of $2.50 for the 10 pork skewers and the rice cake. We will see you guys at the next place. Off to the next part. Off to the next. What else can we find? Do have the shawmai? Shawmai? Yeah. We do? What are we getting? Probably just one of these. Okay, so guys, as you know, what we just ordered the Shaomai Ayam was $1.50, but if you look up here, French fries, hot dogs, sausage, chicken nuggets, and whatever that is on the end, they're all a dollar. For the Shaomai Ayam, which is chicken, like dumplings, it was $1.50 for four. Wow, look at that. Yum. It's gonna be good. Here we are. Let's give it a go. There's a bit of homemade um, sauce here, so I'm gonna try a bit of that as well. If you have to. Really good. Considering at a Chinese restaurant, you know, I think you'd pay at least $8 or something like this. I am Shaomai for $1.50. Mm. It's really good. It's 
nothing wowing. Like I do, I would say I prefer the satay barbie, but for $1.50, it's really good and it's really good quality. And I think it's important to like, support the street food stalls here, so. What's next? Um, we've just stopped beside a little stall just behind us that sells nasi campur. Nasi campur. Nasi campur ayam, which is like a chicken, rice, and accompaniments dish. They usually serve it in a banana leaf. So, um, I really need to be taller, huh? We're gonna give it a go. So, let's go check it out. Alright. Yeah, one of these, please. Do you like this? This. Oh. Oh, very nice, very. Yum. Yummy. Yeah. Okay, so as you guys would have just seen the lovely lady opening this up to show us what it looks like, but it's just these two toothpicks. We were just given a plate, so it opens up into we've got rice, there's some noodles, the chicken, egg, and this is pork floss. I can't say I'm a huge fan of it, but we'll mix it in. There's also beans of some sort, and this was a dollar. So one New Zealand dollar. Let's try a bit. Mm -hmm. Oh, that's so spicy. Oh no. Ryan's turn. Let's try this one. They're all a little bit different. It is spicy, but good. Realistically, you could buy yourself two or three of these and be really full, you know? Quite a basic meal. It's just rice, noodles, chili, a little bit of vegetable, and you've got it all there. I really rate it. 10 out of 10. Okay guys, so we are sitting at around six dollars. Uh, we are gonna go for a bit of a walk and try and find some alternatives. Maybe we'll find a dessert, maybe we'll find a drink. Who knows, but follow us. Okay guys, as you know, we've tried uh, quite a few different types of food today. We thought we would try a dessert kind of uh, food. So it looks like here we've got a place uh, that uh, specializes in fried banana. So while the banana is cooking guys, we thought we would get a little drink as well. Uh, we've just ordered two drinks. We have no idea what flavors they are. I believe one was about 30 cents New Zealand. Um, and the other one I think 50 cents. I'll confirm that in a moment. But let's check it out. It looks amazing. It smells amazing. Does it taste amazing? I think I found my new favorite dessert. At a dollar ninety for all that with the almonds, fantastic. I've made fried banana at home, but uh, this puts mine to shame. Let's put it that way. Just quickly want to mention this is from a store called Yes Banana, uh, and they do a bunch of different flavored bananas, like different toppings. But let's give this one a try. Got a glowing review from Ryan, so. Very hot. Mm -hmm. It's fantastic. You've got the sweet from the banana, and then you've got savory from the coating, sweet from the sauces, and then savory right at the end from the almonds. This, this is good. I would give this probably a good seven and a half, eight out of 10. Okay, so these are the drinks that we got from the stall that was next to the fried banana stall. So, I think this is strawberry. Yeah. Tastes exactly like a strawberry milkshake. That is the best 30 cent strawberry milkshake I have ever had in my life. Let's see Ryan trying his. 
All right, I'll be honest. I have no idea what flavor this is. I'm, it's very hot here at the moment. I'm a bit parched. So whatever it is, I'm sure it will be fantastic. Do the old uh, stab. All right. It's a lemon drink. Fantastic. It's like a lemonade. Not much to it, but again, for 30 cents, can't go wrong. It's also nice to support the locals as well. Okay guys, I think we're done for the day. We've got our drink, we've got our dessert, our fried banana. We've still got half a box left. It'll be a nice little snack later. I'm really full, Sam's really full as well. Um, so from this video, as you can see, we didn't make it to $10. It's very hard to make it to that point and not overload your stomach. We've totaled up the price of everything today and the total came to. I also want to say, obviously we tried a few things today that maybe you've never seen before. That's the whole point of traveling. You know, you need to embrace the culture no matter where you go. At the end of the day, if you buy the ticket, take the ride. That's what I like to think anyway. Um, guys, as always, don't forget to subscribe, follow, like this video if you like it, so we know what's working. Let me know if there's anything you want to see in particular. Just put it in the comments below. I'll personally reply as always. Thanks, guys. Take it easy. Till next time. Let me take you around the corner to arguably the coolest part.